If you want to learn how to create change in your skin in just a couple hours and to look more anti-aged, this is the video for you. Hey everybody, it's Lisa, owner of Peaches Skincare. You can visit us at peachesskincare.com where you will find a plethora of information on our website and our products. And you can also visit us on Instagram, Facebook, or TikTok to learn a little bit more about who I am and my or our beliefs in skincare. If you're new to our channel, I have been a holistic master esthetician for almost four decades. I have three holistic skincare salons, Santa Barbara, California, Naples, Long Beach, California, and Montgomery, Cincinnati, Ohio. And I know how to fix skin. Listen to the video, watch the video all the way through. So many of you ask me questions that are right inside these videos. And I think that we're in a culture of a little bit of laziness. We want a quick fix and a quick video, and I try to make them fast, but listen, because anything worth having takes time. I know for my body at almost 57 that if I don't get on my rower three, four times a week, I am not going to create change in my body, and that's what it's like with your skin. So this video is going to show you a few things that create quick change that lasts, but it's not going to work if you're not consistent and if you don't value your skin and yourself to give yourself that time to do it. And I know a lot of people out there don't wanna take the time, um, maybe are a little lazy, but the fact is you can't be lazy. You have to be willing to listen and learn from someone who actually takes care of skin. Now, if you want to listen to other people that have no idea how to take care of skin except their own, go for it if that's what brings you joy. But if you want change, this is the place for you. So a lot of you ask me about the frownies or the facial patches. And these are what frownies look like. And some of you, hundreds of you have said, oh, I don't feel like it makes a difference. I don't see changes. The fact is, is we always make expression with our face. And that's the beautiful thing about being human, laughing, crying, scowling, whatever it might be. Frowny patches you wear at night. I like to put mine on my 11s and some of my clients like to put it here or on their eyes or even down on their chest area, right between. And it's about consistency. You can't use these for two months and then text me or call me and say they're not working. You have to be consistent for months and years and you will see changes. I promise you, I've been selling frownies for about 25 years in our salons and they're incredible. They use a vegetable adhesive, all you do is you hold it to the area that you want, and then during the night while you're sleeping, it tells the brain not to move that muscle, so it creates muscle memory, just like all the massages and things that I teach you. But again, it is consistency. Taking them off in the morning, I splash my face with water, and it's very easy. There shouldn't be any irritation. Um, they're amazing, but you have to be consistent. I'm just gonna keep saying that. The other thing, gut health. You can't have healthy skin or a healthy body or healthy organs or healthy anything if you don't drink your apple cider vinegar. Now, I use Bragg's. I also use one from Costco. I think Trader Joe's has one. Just make sure that you see the film in it or the mother. It's like a little sediment. And what I do is, yes, you know we use apple cider vinegar on our skin. I have an apple cider vinegar toner. We'll show it to you right now but we drink apple cider vinegar, my husband and I, every night. You fill it halfway, add a little bit of water, drink it down quickly, and then follow it with water. Again, this is consistency. If it's you in your 60, if it's you in your 40, or if it's your teenager who's struggling, if you don't have, sorry, there's a helicopter going over, if you don't have healthy gut health and flora, it shows on your face. It's a little, maybe gross to you, but it's everyone poos. But if you're not pooing regularly, for example, you will see breakout on your skin. So be consistent. People ask me all the time, how long? For the rest of your life. We have been drinking apple cider vinegar for about 10 or 12 years. Do your apple cider vinegar. Another quick little fix is when I'm feeling like maybe I've gotten a little bit of sun and I wear a wide brimmed hat all the time, but I do live in Southern California and maybe my lines right here, 
when they look a little uh, deeper, it's because the inside maybe got a little bit of sun and it only takes about three to four minutes to burn or create color. We have melanocytes and when melanocytes grow or change, they darken your skin. I will take a little black Jamaican castor oil. My peaches know that we wear it under our eyes and over our eyes right before bed and right before putting on our milk and magnesia. You should have done your PM routine early in the evening. That's another thing all of you ask. And I tell you on so many videos, watch these videos all the way through if you want to create change. I'll take a little black Jamaican castor oil. I'll rub it into those areas and I'll just let it sit while I'm doing all my massages and um, I do have my facial oil on prior. And then I'll put milk and magnesia around it and it is amazing the change it creates within just one night of sleeping with it on. Another thing, I will take Peach's Polish. This is a natural lactic acid of milk and sugar. It is akin to what Cleopatra did living in a very harsh environment. She used to use an enzyme. There's all this literature on it. And essentially I will take the polish and I'll just work it into a wrinkle that looks like it just looks a little darker, which again, it may appear deeper, but it's really that the inside has dead skin cells or it has been darkened by the sun or it's just old tissue because you're not exfoliating daily, morning and night. Again, morning and night, be consistent with your flawless exfoliator. But polish, just working that in there, letting it sit for a minute or 20 seconds and rinsing it off, you will create change in one time. Flawless exfoliator, I don't have that, but since I brought it up, Flawless Exfoliator is the exfoliator. Classic Cleanser is a cleanser. The beads you, you feel in your cleanser are jojoba beads that burst and create moisture because of the papaya or papin and the uh, grapefruit. We use natural enzymatic fruit enzymes or glycolic acids. And so we like that moisture so that your skin takes it in and it works easier. But if you don't exfoliate with Flawless Exfoliator morning and night, you're not going to see change. You've got to rid the skin of that old tissue before you wash with your cleanser. Another thing, don't be afraid of baking soda. Baking soda should be done one to two times a week and so many of you are reaching out to me and you're saying, my skin feels a little irritated and I'll say, oh, how often are you doing baking soda? Oh, every day, twice a day. And I tell you in these videos all the time, one to two times a week, get your baking soda wet just like this, get it into a little circular motion on your face, do it for about 10 seconds and rinse it off. Do that one to two times a week and you will be shocked at the change you see. You'll see it in one washing. If your skin can handle doing baking soda more, you can certainly do it, but start with one to two times a week. Couple more things, Miracle Mask. This is pumpkin and papaya in its purest form. Some people will say it smells a little bit. It's because it has kaolin in it or clay, and that is normal. Also, we use organic and natural products. We don't put fragrances or perfumes. So you're smelling what that product smells like at that moment because it's in its natural state. A wonderful way to just help your skin to feel tighter and firmer, and it will also take away any brown spots or any extra sun damage you've had. I wake up in the morning every day, and before I make my bed, I will wash with Restore. We'll show it right over here to the side. It's an antibacterial, especially after sweating and sleeping all night, and for goodness sake, wash your faces every day. And then I'll put Miracle Mask on for about 20 minutes while I make the bed. Rinse it off. I may do a couple chores, do my workout, and then do my AM routine, okay? Two more things. Use eye gels or eye patches every day if you'd like to. Every time I put my eyeliner on, which is every day, I just put a little patch under my eye. I love the Dermatology eye gels and I love these eye, eye masks. We sell these on our website, Karuna. They're fantastic. You will see change immediately because the eye area many times has almost an allergy to it from sleeping and nasal passages getting clogged during the night, different pollen and hairs from your dogs and cats in the air. And when you just hydrate that area and give it that special attention, you will be shocked at how amazing it looks within just minutes, just minutes. And finally, 
So many are telling me my chin is breaking out. What's going on? It has nothing to do with stress. It has nothing to do with hormones. Hormones heat us up, make us retain water, and our body naturally wants to clean out anything that's stuck in our pores or our hair follicles. And so if your hair follicles are clogged, which are your pores, it's, it's going to clean out at that time. But if you've been a client of ours for 10, 5, 15 years, 5, 10, 15 years, you just don't break out anymore. And if you do, there's a reason. But one of the reasons is because you pluck. You pluck your eyebrows and you pluck your chin. Stop plucking. Shave those areas. You can use a regular razor in the shower with your cleanser. I'll put my cleanser on and just shave or you can take one of these and just work up and this is actually how I do my eyebrows. And I keep my eyebrows up every day. That's just what I like to do. It takes time, but it makes me feel put together, if you will. You know I wear no foundation and concealer. If you cheat and wear it, you're going to break out. If you cheat and wear sunscreen, I don't recommend, you're going to break out. And if you mix anything with peaches in the beginning, you're going to break out. It's that simple. You've got to stick to a regimen and you've got to do it consistently and you will see changes. I hope this helped you. I hope you know you can ask me anything with love and kindness below if there's a video you'd like to see or a question that you have. And I hope you all uncover your true confidence.